Hey, Islam family. I want to do a slightly different type of video today. Uh, it's my intro to silver or buying silver. Uh, I want to go over four different types uh, just to give people a general idea. I'm not going to really go into prices too much because they change a lot. They've been fluctuating, uh, going up, up lately. Um, so, first, um, here. This is a government silver. Uh, silver coin issued. This one is 1890. It's called a Morgan uh, Eagle on the back. Now, um, this particular one here, I'm going to weigh it up real quick. Show you. All right, this one's about 25.7 grams. This scale is a little off sometimes. Um, but it's a little bit less than an ounce. Now this one here is what they call generic silver. It's just from a different mint. But uh, when I drop it on the scale, it's a troy ounce, which is uh, a little off. It's 31.1, let's see if I can get it to come up right. Yeah, that's a troy ounce. All right, now, um, this is pure 999 silver as opposed to the government one uh, here, which is only about 90% silver. It's not as pure. Now, this one here, uh, this one's also pure silver 0.999, um, but it is jewelry. It's going to weigh up a little different with the chain and all of that, too. I'm gonna just, uh, let's see if I can drop it on here. Show you about what that's weighing up 55 grams. All right. And, um,. The other type of silver is silver with stones. So, um, getting tangled up. There's a different weight uh, when it comes to it with stones. But this type of jewelry in particular, uh, most of them is not totally pure. It's 0.925. I'm not sure if it, I can get this. Uh, zoom in that looks like it there but yeah so that's 92.5 percent uh, pure so when it comes to the price you know in buying silver you know you definitely want to consider uh what you're buying you know whether you're getting uh let's say a government coin which you know just because it's old they some are, are more collectible than others but on a meltdown value it's only going to have uh, you know, in the 90 percentile um, impurity, and then it's less than an ounce versus, you know, a troy ounce, which is more than a, a ounce, um, and it's pure, you know, so you're going to get that full value, you know, pretty much the same thing um, when you're getting your jewelry. It's going to be a little bit better than the government coins, but it's not going to be quite as good as the pure on the value, but one thing that I do want to say um, that's interesting, um, when it comes to selling your jewelry or selling these coins, it's a little bit easier to sell coins to, you know, liquidate them and get that ounce value versus, uh, let's say, one of these chains where you could do the same thing, but you wouldn't necessarily um, get as much for it. Um, as the full ounce because I want to say like this one here is maybe 23 grams which is a little bit less than 28 this one here is like 11 and a half or something like that there this piece by itself I want to say it's maybe like 8 grams um, so when you collect it in, in jewelry forms it'll be in smaller increments and um, you're less likely to sell it is what I discovered you know than the ounces but i do have a, a lot of the ounces but you know usually when it comes to liquidating any of it you know those are usually the ones that go first you know jewelry usually sticks around a lot longer and then you know after buying and buying and buying you know if you're collecting like me just um to get as much as you can you know adding value when you start calculating how much you have you'll be surprised in, in, you know that you may have more ounces in jewelry than you do in physical coin or uh ounce bars you know pretty cool in here i like my statement piece but um you know i just really do love the different types of silver you can get out here um you know anything at least 925 is good jewelry. You know, 925 Italy, you know, that's good to go. That's not gonna 
um, be fake for the most part. They don't generally fake silver, but you know you can clean silver and uh, you can get tarnish remover and things of that sort. There's cleaner for the stones, um, any color, but you know, just you know, little brief intro, you know, to buying silver that I think will help people. Peace and love. Man.